So the Euros has given us some of the best goals we have ever seen. But today, I'm going to be building a team of players that have scored some of the best goals in the Euros history. I'm going to take these teams into the game, and every goal is by me, a random discard. So let's start with the bench. I've got a couple of super subs, and of course, Ronaldo in here. With his insane back heel flick versus Hungary in Euro 2016. What a finish, my friend. And Jordan Shakiri. Every tournament he scores a good goal. No matter the tournament, this was in Euro 2016 as well, though. Against Poland with his overhead kick. Moving on to the starting 11. In goal, you're going to be wondering which goalkeeper is called the best goal. But it was Peter Schmeichel with a penalty versus Belgium in Euro 2000. And he is the only goalkeeper to score a goal in the tournament. Our first centre back is going to be Sergio Ramos. Again with a penalty but a beautiful Penenka penalty in Euro 2012 in a penalty shootout versus Portugal. And again, another penalty taker, Harry Maguire. And you remember it, we did lose the final versus Italy, but Harry Maguire's penalty was so good it broke the camera. It's insane. Right back is going to be Philip Lahm. But his goal versus Turkey in Euro 2008 sealed a 3-2 victory versus them with a last minute winner from Philip Lahm himself. Top bins, beautiful composed finish. And final person on the right defence at left back is Jordi Alba. Euro 2012 versus Italy bursting forward from the halfway line before calmly slotting that ball in with that left foot of his. Before we move on to the final six players of the team, some honourable mentions for some of the best Euro goals ever that are players that are not on this game. So sadly Pogba of course got banned but that goal versus Switzerland in Euro 2020 was one of my favourite goals ever scored with a celebration as well. Then we've got Platini of France who scored a beautiful free kick versus Yugoslavia in Euro 88 which was a competition that had so many good goals. Just wait and see. You've got Ibrahimovic versus Italy. Again just a beautiful flick. That, that is classic Ibra. Ronnie Whelan's insane scissor kick versus the Soviet Union in Euro 88 as well. And Hal robson Carno for Wales versus Belgium, Cruyff turn, the best goal in Welsh history, maybe. Gareth Bell might actually have something to say about that. But CDM is not even a CDM, but it is Rude Hullet. Off chemistry, I know, but that powerful head of his in Euro 88 final versus the Soviet Union, classic Hullet. Right mid, Luis Figo. And this has come up for his goal versus England. 30 yard screamer, David Seaman, no chance. That guy was stuck to the floor. Left mid, gonna be Lorenzo Insigne. But Italy versus Belgium in Euro 2020. He received the ball on the halfway line, dribbled past a few players, had some close control for an unstoppable run before cutting in and curling that top bins. Keeper, no chance. Now in Cam, this is arguably gonna be the player with the best goal ever scored in Euro history. Some say best goal ever scored, Van Basten. Of course, also in Euro 88, his iconic volley versus the Soviet Union in the final. This guy had no right to score a goal like that. Okay, finals players and our strikers. Now these are some of the best goals as well. So first one is gonna be Patrick Schick. After that insane goal versus Scotland, halfway line, keeper off his line, and he just smacked over him. Goal of the tournament in Euro 2020 as well. And final player, Davos Suka. Euro 96. Denmark versus Croatia. Peter Schmeichel goal, by the way. Not an easy keeper to score again, but he's chipped him like he's not even there. Caught another player with no right to score a goal like that. Insane. But there we go. That is the final team of some of the best goals ever scored in the Euros history. What's been your favourite goal of the Euros ever? Let me know in the comments. But it's time to take this team into a game. I remember every goal I lose by would be a random discard. And this is the team we're facing. Come on, let's try and score some of these beautiful goals with these players. Now, one thing I haven't said is that if I don't recreate three goals, in this game, I have to delete the whole club. Nope. What's Takaramas? Oh my god. And we're one up down. <laughs> Lovely. So a player that can't even get any minutes in the Euros. Come on, we've got to win this game, surely. And shit. Bang. We're back in it. Not as good as that Euro goal, but a goal is a goal. Nope. What a save, Schmeichel. Best keeper in Euros history. Nope. Oh, he's gone for the chip. <laughs> He's tried to recreate it, but it's not worked. But that is Hullet doing what Hullet does best, scoring headers. So that is one goal recreated. Oh, come on, man. That's Figo, though. Nope. Oof. Insigne. Bang. Let's go. Does that count as another goal recreated? Is it finesse? I'm taking it. Two seconds later. Oh my god! Rubbish, it's because it's half time. But it's 3 3 at half time. And we still need to recreate one goal and win the game. Second half, let's go. I love it. I love that. I love that shit. 
What a goal. So only one more goal I need to recreate to tick off the three. And the best way to do it, probably get a penalty. Nope. Suka's up for the chip again. Let's try and score our own insane goal. Nope. Or not. <laughs> Let's go. Alarm, top bins. That counts. And is a winner. That surely counts. Come on. There we go. We won with the greatest goals in Euro's history team. And we created three. That saves everyone. Again, let me know your favourite goal that's ever been scored in the Euros in the comments. Make sure you drop a like and subscribe. And while you're here, it's time to watch another one of these videos.